Hello guys, we have this equation t minus 1 all power 6 equal to t power 6 and we have to solve this uh, equation for the value of t. So let's start the solution of this equation. So first of all we will send this t minus 1 all power 6 on uh, this side of the equation. So let's send it. So it will become t power 6 minus t minus 1 all power 6 equal to 0. And now we can write this equation as t power 3 into 2 minus t minus 1 all power 3 into 2 is equal to 0 as 3 times 2 equal to 6. So we can write this equation in the form of this. Now according to exponent rule, if we have a power uh, m uh, a power m into n, so we can write this a power m all power n and this is called power of power rule. So according to this power of power rule, we can write this equation as t cube into a square and minus t minus 1 all cube power 2. So we can write this equation in this form which is equal to 0. And now according to identity formula, so we can write this as uh, a square minus b square into a minus b, a square minus b square equal to a minus b into a plus b. So we now we will expand this question in the form of uh, this expanded form. So here we have a equal to t cube, a equal to t cube and b equal to t minus 1 all power cube or 3. So let's expand this formula. So this is a and this is b. So this this question is the form of a square minus b square. So let's expand it into a minus b in, into a plus b. So this will become a minus b into a plus b equal to 0. So now we will compare these two values with 0. So we can write as t cube minus uh, t minus 1 all cube equal to 0 and similarly we can also compare this with 0 so we can write t cube plus t minus 1 all cube equal to 0 so now we have these two equation one equation is this one and the other equation is this so now we will solve these two equations separately for the value of t so let's take this equation first and uh, solve it for the value of t so this equation t cube minus uh, t minus 1 all power 3 equal to 0. Now, according to cube formula, we know that a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b into a square plus a b plus b square. So here we have a is equal to t and b is equal to t minus 1. So a is equal to t. this is our a and this is our t minus 1 is uh, our b. So let's expand. Uh, this equation according to this formula so it will become a minus b that is t minus t minus 1 into a square that is t square plus a b this is a and this is b and plus b square t minus 1 is or b and square of it so this will become t minus t plus 1 this t minus t and this minus will when multiply with this 1 so it will become minus minus plus so it will become 1 and here this will become t square and uh, this t when multiply with this so it will become t square and this plus minus equal minus so it will become minus t and here this is formula t minus 1 whole square so it will become t square minus 2t plus 1 so this will become t square minus 2t plus 1 now look over here this is t square this is t square and this is t square so it will become 3t square and similarly this is minus t and this is minus 2t so it will become minus 3t and this plus 1 and here this t will cancel this t so it will become 1 so we can write this as 1 into 3t square minus 3t plus 1 equal to 0 now this will become 3t square minus 3t plus 1 equal to 0 so now this equation is uh, in the form of quadratic equation. So now we will apply quadratic formula 
on this equation solid supply quadratic formula so according to for quadratic formula t is equal to minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4 ac divided by 2a so here in this equation we have a is equal to 3 a is equal to 3 and b is equal to minus 3 and c is equal to 1 like here so now we will put these values in this quadratic formula so let's put the value so it will become minus and uh, b is minus 3 so minus 3 plus minus b is minus 3 b cube minus 4 is uh, 3 and c is 1 and here 2a so a is 3 so it will become this minus and this minus will become 3 and plus minus this will become 3 and plus minus this will become 9 minus 3 square equal to 9 and this will become minus 12 and divided by this 2 3 is a 6 so it will become 6 so now this will become 9 minus 12 equal to minus 3 so this will become 3 plus minus under the root minus 3 divided by 6 and now this minus 3 look over here we can write this minus 3 is equal to s minus 1 into 3 and similarly we will uh, write this as under root minus 1 into under root 3 which is equal to iota under root 3 why because under root minus 1 is equal to iota and this under root 3 so it means that we can write this under root minus 3 equal to iota under the root 3 so let's write over here so it will become 3 plus minus iota under root 3 divided by 6 now we will uh, write separately these two values because these are two values so we will write separately the plus and minus so it will become t equal to 3 plus iota under root 3 divided by 6 and 3 minus iota under root 3 divided by 6 so these are two values of t which we have solved but in the start of question i have told you that there are two sections so this is the answer of first section now we will solve the other section of the question which is this one t cube plus t minus 1 all power 3 equal to 0 so now again we will apply cube formula over here but remember in the first section there was uh, minus and now we have plus so we will apply the plus formula for this equation so as we know that a a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square like this a cube plus b cube equal to a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square so here in this uh, equation we have a equal to t and b equal to t minus 1 so look over here a equal to t and b equal to t minus 1 so when we expand this question according to this formula so it will become a plus b into a square minus a b this is a and this is your b so a b plus b square b is t minus 1 and is squared so when we expand this so it will become this will become t plus t minus 1 and this will become t square and here this will become minus t square and minus minus plus so it will become t and similarly this will become at as it is t minus 1 whole square yeah all square so it will become t square minus 2t plus 1 now this t plus t equal to 2t minus 1 and this t square minus t square will cancel each other so the remaining term over here in the square is this only t square so we will write this t square and similarly we have this plus t and minus 2t so plus t minus 2t equal to minus t so we will write minus t over here and this plus 1 so we will write plus 1 over here which is equal to 0 now we will compare these two values with 0 so 2t minus 1 equal to 0 and t square minus t plus 1 equal to 0 so let's compare it so 2t minus 1 equal to 0 and this t square minus t plus 1 equal to 0. So now this uh, uh, will become t is equal to 1 divided by 2. 
this t is equal to 1 divided by 2 and again this is quadratic equation in the form of x square plus bx plus c equal to 0. So now we will apply quadratic formula on this equation. So let's apply quadratic formula on this equation. But here we have a equal to 1 and b equal to minus 1 and c equal to 1. So like this a equal to 1, b is equal to minus 1 and c is equal to 1. So put, put, now put this value these values in this quadratic formula so this will become uh, minus minus 1 plus minus under the root b square that is minus 1 square minus 4 a c and divided by 2 a as 1 so this will become this minus and minus will become 1 and plus minus this will become 1 square minus uh, this will become 4 divided by 2 so t equal to 1 plus minus this will become minus 3 divided by 2 and again we can write this uh, under root minus 3 as uh, iota under root 3. So look over here we can write this uh, under root minus 3 as uh, 1 plus minus iota under root 3 divided by 2. Now we will write separately these two values as iota uh, is equal to under root minus 1 as I have told earlier to you guys. So when we write these separately, so it will become 1 plus iota under root 3 divided by 2 and 1 minus iota under root 3 divided by 2. Now here we have three values of t, two values are these and the other value is this. So overall we have five values of t. This was uh, our given question t minus 1 all power 6 is equal to t power 6 and we have values five values over here, five solution of this uh, t. So the first one is 3 plus iota under root 3 divided by 6. This is second one, this is third one, this is fourth one and this is fifth one. In these five solutions, we have only one real solution that is t equal to 1 divided by 2 and all other four solutions are complex or imaginary solution. So this was the solution of this given question. If you have any kind of question, so please ask in comments. I hope you will like this video, so please subscribe my channel for further videos. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.